my life-changing accident. I was at a rodeo waiting to take my turn in the barrel race. My horse Pepsi and I had been practicing a lot and had started to get really fast. It was a cold, rainy day and the arena was super muddy, but it wasn't anything I hadn't rode in before. When the gates opened Pepsi and I started off perfectly. Once we got to the first barrel we turned tight and fast. The second barrel seemed to be going perfectly too. All of a sudden I hear a loud noise, felt a big hit, and then was flying across the arena. When I opened my eyes I was laying in the cold wet mud with a bunch of people staring down at me. I was taken to the ambulance and was being treated immediately. An EMT asked me if something hurt and I felt an extremely sharp pain in my left wrist. In the ambulance I passed out again and when I woke up I was in a small ER exam room with a bunch of people all around me. Once everyone was out of the room the doctor told my mom and I that I was going to have to surgery to fix the damage that was done to my wrist. The doctor also said that it would probably take anywhere from three weeks to three months for my wrist to heal. As I sat and waited to go into surgery I realized that I might never compete in barrel racing, pole bending, team roping, or go tying again if my wrist didn't heal perfectly and even if it did heal perfectly it would never feel the same again when I threw a rope. I sat in my hospital bed trying to figure out why this had happened to me. I had ridden horses my whole life and wasn't some inexperienced girl that didn't know what I was doing. I accidentally asked myself two very important questions out loud. Who am I without my spurs, hat, and saddle? And what was I going to do with my life now? My mom, who hadn't left my side the entire time, gave me a reassuring answer that I just ignored because as my mother she is obligated to say nice things about me. In that moment I actually had no idea what I was going to do with my future. On my way to the operating room I finally gave up on answering my own questions and decided that I could figure out the answers during the upcoming recovery time I faced. In the OR the doctor had me count down from 20 and when I got to 15 he said, Bailey you just won your rodeo. And with that I drifted off to the best dream I had ever had, winning at the NFR.